we have seven issues. This looks like it's more on the front end side of things. We have some cross-site scripting vulnerabilities potentially here. You can see we have unsanitized input from data from a remote resource flows into inner HTML, where it is used dynamically to construct the HTML page on the client side. We have a DOM-based cross-site scripting attack vulnerability here in this code on the left-hand side, where we're displaying the notes function. So good to be aware of that and fix that. I'm gonna try and click on generate AI fix using deep code AI fix here. All right, so here are some solutions that we could potentially use to address the cross-site scripting vulnerability. And what it's suggesting essentially is to use a function to escape the HTML to make sure the data is safe to use and render within the context of HTML, whereas before we were not doing that. And then we can apply the fix too, if we want. And just like that, we're down to seven issues. Look at that. Thanks to Sneak pointing it out and then helping to generate a fix for us there.